Dear students and participants, I welcome you all to the annual science quiz competition organized by Private Universal Private School. I am thrilled to see your enthusiasm and dedication to science. Today you will have the opportunity to showcase your knowledge and experience and cyclists. So I wish you all the best and let us get started. This competition will be having total number of six questions for each group. You have to understand this. Six questions for the each group, okay? That means total number of questions will be 12. And if the group is not able to answer the question, that question will be passed to the next group. And each question is having five points. If the group is not able to answer the question, it will be passed to the opponent group. And if opponent group is able to answer the same question, they will get only two points. And for each question, you have 60 seconds. That means one minute. In 60 seconds, you have to decide the answer. Okay, if there is tie up, in case if there is tie up, you will have additional questions, but the quickest answer will be accepted from the group and the group will be winner. Okay, let's start. This is for boys. Name the organelle responsible for the production of ATP, the energy currency of the cell. Mitochondria. Mitochondria. Yes. This is the right answer. Okay, this is the right answer. Mitochondria is the right answer and boys got five points. Now, second question is for girls. What animal has heart in its head? You have two options, spider or shrimp? Uh, shrimp. Shrimp, yeah. This is the right answer. So, girls got five points for this question. Next question for boys. What is the bird that, if it gets sick, kills itself? Option one, eagle. Option two, falcon. You think the bird, when it gets old, it kills itself? Eagle. Eagle. I think it's the right answer. Yes, eagle is the right answer. Now, fourth question is for the girls. What is the fastest animal on the, on the earth? Lion or cheetah? The cheetah. Cheetah, okay. Okay, both are going good. Next question for... Bo okay, it's the answer, right? Next question for, from chemistry, it is for the boys. What are the subatomic particles found in the atom? Electron, proton, neutron. Okay, I think this is the right answer. Yes, this is the right answer. You have to be serious, right? What is the chemical formula for sulfuric acid? Girls? Uh, H2SO4. H2SO4 is the right answer. Next question for boys. Which of the following element is a noble gas? Helium, nitrogen, oxygen? Helium. Helium, right? I think it's helium, helium yes. Helium is the right answer. Next question for girls. What is the pH of a neutral solution? Seven. 14, seven, zero. Seven. Seven. Seven is right answer. Next question for, from physics, it is for the boys. What is the fundamental difference between scalar and vector quantities in physics? You have to give the answer. What is the fundamental difference between scalar and vector quantities? You have 60 seconds, you can think, you can discuss.
Yes. Uh, vector has a direction that's color present. Okay. This all? If your answer is wrong, then you will get zero, right? If it is right, they will get the marks, right? But you have to also tell. What is the answer? Uh, a scalar quantity is o has only magnitude, while a vector quantity has magnitude and direction. Direction. Okay. Let us see the answer. Scalar quantities only have magnitude, while vector quantities have both magnitude and direction. So girls are? They get two points for the question number five. And boys get zero. Next question will be for the girls. Explain the principle of conservation of energy. Um, energy can't be created or destroyed. It can only be transferred. Okay. So, I think this is the right answer. Because everyone knows conservation of energy. Okay. It's okay, okay, sorry. This is zero and you got two here, right? It's okay. Six question. Now next question will be for boys. What is the bending of light as it passes from one medium to another due to a change in its speed? Reflection of light, refraction of light, diffraction of light. B. Refraction is the right answer. Yes, refraction is the right answer. So boys get five points. Okay. Okay, next question for you is what is the unit for energy? Joules. Joules. Okay, it's the right answer. So girls get five. So I think we are done here, right? Yes, we are done. So we will calculate the points here. Boys got 25 points and girls got 32 points. So girls win, give them a big hand. We just said to give them a big hand, so you have to be. Okay. So here we have some <laughs> prizes. Karen, Nicole, and Zan. Karen, Nicole. This is for the winner? Okay. Is this good? Take this. And this. Right. Zena? Okay. So this is for you. And this is for Farah. Congratulations you all. So we did well. So there will be certificates for the boys. Uh, it's Karim. Get a Moz Moz Walid and Kali. Okay, thank you all. So in this way we conclude. You have to take a message to the home. Okay, what is the message of this program? To inculcate in yourself the scientific attitude and the learning cycles. Right? So wish you all the best for next time. Thank you all. Thank you.